Hey, Paul Van Dyke of King Kong Constrictors. I just put another video up uh, just the other day, but the lighting was really bad, so I thought I'd put up another one. It's a beautiful sunny day out, and uh, you can really get a good idea as to what the snakes look like with the sun shining on them. And I'll talk about pairings and uh, plans that I have of putting them together and all that kind of stuff too. So let's get started. I'll show you the snakes again. So uh, we'll start with the bumblebee. This is a female, female bumblebee. If you get in the sunlight, you just get a really, uh, really good idea as to how beautiful these snakes can be. Their uh, colors and their patterns. Then we have the spider, female spider. She just shed, so she's got some uh, real crisp markings right now. Sides are nice and white. All these snakes came from Royal Constrictor Designs, except for two of them. I got the normal female from the local reptile show, and the male Mojave from PHB Enterprise. Otherwise, the other six are from Garrick the Meyer. This is the male Pastave. This is, uh, out of all of them, I think, as far as the crispness of color and just pattern and, and rich vibrancy, this one's probably my favorite. Personally, I've never seen a Pastave that looks like this. Let's see, and we have a female mystic. And the male super blast. Nice looking guy. And then the male Mojave. As soon as we're trying to get out here. He's a nice looking guy too. Open up another tub. Just got a couple more left to show you. This is the female Mojave, Mojave, however you want to say it. And finally the normal female. From a local reptile show. I can't remember. It's a actually somebody that's breeding ball pythons that lives close by. I just so happened to uh, be at the reptile show, the local reptile show, and uh, looking for an adult normal female. So basically, I want to talk about a couple pairings, let you know what I'm going to have available in a couple years. I'm going to put the Super Blast, the male Super Blast with the spider, female, obviously. And I should be getting some Spinner Blasts, Lemon Blasts, Bumblebees, and Pastels from these two. And the idea I had when I, uh, when I first decided to, to do this was I didn't need to go crazy with super expensive morphs. I just want to be able to produce something out of the ordinary and uh, that, that everybody can afford. And so that was the kind of the idea when I when I chose which ones I wanted. And then next would be uh, Super Blast and Bumblebee. I was going to get two spiders to begin with, but 
I really like bumblebees. So with these two, I'll be having uh, Killer Blast, Super Blast, Killer Bees, Super Pastels, Spinner Blast, Lemon Blast, Bumblebees, and Pastels. So there's uh, a lot of stuff that could come out of these two. It'd be neat to see what the heck comes out of the, those pairings. I got, I got everything written down here, so there's a lot of stuff that could uh, possibly happen, so it's kind of hard to remember. Next, I have the, I'm going to put the male Pastave with the female Mojave. And, uh, let's see, that's uh, this guy. This guy with the uh, female Mojave. And uh, sh that'll give me a chance at some Super Mojaves, some Pastel Super Mojaves, which are Blue-Eyed Lucy's. Um, Pastaves, Pastels, uh, I think there's 25% chance of uh, Super Mojave and uh, Pastel Super Mojave, and then uh, Mojaves and Normals. Then I'll be putting together the male Mojave with the Mystic and uh, the big deal, the reason I, I chose a Mystic was because my favorite ball python of all time is a Mystic Potion and uh, I really wanted to be able to produce those so I'll be able to have some Mystic Potions, Mojaves, Mystics and Normals out of that which I'm happy I'm going to be producing Normals because uh, actually the, the biggest the, the people are actually waiting in line for, for Normals for me and. Uh, you know, so I'm happy that I'm going to be producing that for, for people that don't necessarily want to spend a bunch of money on a ball python, but want one nonetheless. And uh, then, last but not least, Super Blast is going to be crossed with the normal, which will give me some lemon blasts and pastels. So, you know, nothing crazy expensive, nothing, it's not like Nerd or Constrictors Unlimited or anything like that producing these brand new morphs that are going to be thousands of dollars. It's just going to be, you know, really cool snakes in... Uh, I don't know, it'll be, it'll be fun to see what I get, and should have uh, some Lemon Blast and Pastels this coming season, and then within the next two to three years, all that other stuff will come out, and uh, I'll keep you posted and updated. Thanks for watching my videos. Take it easy.